to be able to compile and simulate circuit written Vero. Icarus Vero and GTK Wave can be used. This is a binary error with two inputs, an upper sum and parity. And we can write very log description for this error circuit. This is its corresponding description in Verilog. In a test bench description, the original error circuit description is included. And the error circuit is, in, is instantiated along with its test bench pattern. On this system, Icarus Verilog has already been built and installed through the cycle. We can compile this Verilog circuit module in its test bench and simulate the circuit. Take a look at the simulated results with the GTK way. This is the input test pattern and the results of the circuit sum and carry series. Let's go back to the original state and go through the Verilog installation steps. To install Verilog, go to URL iVerilogEcarus.com and download it. In order to view simulated plots, we also need to install GTK Wave. You can get GTK Wave from SourceForge.com and download it. Copy or move the download Icarus, Verilog, and GTK Wave to user folder in Sigrid's drive. Now let's build Icarus, Verilog, and GTK Waves from source. Bring up X terminal. Extract the compressed source. Configure the bill. Build it with make. Install with make install. Test run the Icarus Verilog. Go ahead, try to build GTK Wave. Extract the compressed source. Configure the build. Build it with make. Install with make install. Let's run GTK Wave to see if the installation is alright. Now Icarus Verilog is ready to go. This completes the presentation. Gracias. Hasta la vista. Adios.